The chairman of the House of Representatives Committee on Navy, Yusuf Gagdi, on Monday said Nigeria is ripe enough now to have a Marine Corps due to its vast maritime resources and the increasing threats to maritime security in the nation's waterways. He further stressed that the Nigerian Marine Corps is a strategic initiative to enhance the country's maritime prowess, protect the waters, and foster a secure environment for the trade and economic growth. Honorable Gagde said these are the public hearing organized by the Committee on Navy in respect to the proposed Nigerian Marine, the Nigerian Marine Corps Bill at the National Assembly Complex. While expressing gratitude to the Speaker Abbas Tajanin for his unwavering support for the critical initiative, the lawmakers said the bill represents a proactive step towards safeguarding national interests and ensuring the safety of the coastal and marine environments. Establishing the maritime Nigerian Maritime Corps is not merely a legislative effort, but it should be a strategic initiative based on the idea of the sponsor of the bill to enhance maritime prowess, protect our waters, and foster a secure environment for trade and economic growth. Given Nigerian vast maritime resources and the increasing threat, again according to the sponsor of the bill, to maritime security, this bill represents a proactive step towards safeguarding our national interest and ensuring the safety of the coastal and maritime environment. While declaring the hearing open, the Speaker Tajuddin Abbas said the focus on mar marine intervention is firmly rooted in the legislative agenda of the Tenth House, particularly in relation to its goals of economic diversification and agricultural development. The focus on marine intervention is firmly rooted in the legislative agenda of the Tenth House of Representatives, particularly in our goals of economic diversification and agricultural development. Central to these goals is the exploration and sustainable development of the blue economy. This aligns closely with our commitment to addressing climate change and promoting environmental sustainability. Among other efforts, this includes engaging stakeholders to review the national oceans policy, which emphasizes the sustainable management and conservation of Nigeria's marine and coastal resources. However, some stakeholders, including civil society organizations, kicked against it for reasons based on duplication as well as national security. This venture, now with due respect, perhaps this adventure, is a recipe for confusion. Most importantly, what threat analysis was carried out, like somebody said? What does this call intend to do differently? And like many others have said, why not strengthen already existing agencies, already existing services to do their work? Nigeria used to be a high-risk area in terms of piracy. But with our efforts, Nigeria was removed from the list of piracy born countries as far back as 2022. All of these add up to the commercial and economic prosperity of this country. We're talking of investor confidence, we're talking of insurance premiums and all of that. They all have a direct linkage to the economic prosperity of this country. The enforcement of all relevant federal laws within the maritime zones of Nigeria falls under the jurisdiction of the Nigerian Navy as provided in section one, subsection 4A of the Armed Forces Act 2004. It is therefore curious that the Nigeria Maritime Corps Bill 2024 uh, provides that Marine Corps will enforce or provide assistance in the enforcement of all relevant federal laws within the maritime zones of Nigeria that fall under the jurisdiction of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. During the hearing, Honorable Gagdi assured Nigerians that due diligence would be done in carrying out legislative actions on the bill. It says the committee is an impartial body and would not take sides in carrying out its assignment. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.